What's up mates, it's your boy Force Chosen One here, bringing you another Borderlands 2 video. But before we start, I'd like to say a thank you and give a shout out to the RC Genius. He recently gave me a shout out on one of his videos and I'd like to return the favour. He has an amazing knowledge on RC cars and does brilliant videos on them. If you're into that sort of thing, make sure to go over to his channel, and leave a comment and leave a like. Make sure to sub and to share his content. Anyway, let's get into this video. I'm trying to help out people here because some people still don't know about legendaries at the beginning of the game and how to make it so easy for you to start the game off. You can get so many levels off just farming the beginning bosses and getting their awesome loot that will carry you through the beginning of the game. So we start off with Knuckle Dragger. He drops the Hornet. He is literally first few minutes within the game and he drops a legendary. It's a corrosive dial pistol. It only ever comes in this in this unique way but even then it still melts through enemies as you can see in this demonstration just melts through bandits and corrosive is supposed to be for armored enemies um well this kind of proves it wrong really doesn't it but there's a downside the hornet doesn't perform well when it comes to ultimate vault hunter mode or any op levels for that i definitely recommend a gun such as the unkempt herald which i will do another video on if this video manages to get 10 likes so make sure you smash that like button so in this next bit I show off the ability of the Kablaster and show you how to get it you have to kill Midgemong he is a side quest mini boss that you get from Hamlock it's the last quest you get from Hamlock in the southern shelf so make sure to do this quest and come kill Midgemong the Kablaster is OP when it shoots, it lets out a mini grenade after it explodes for the f after the first time. So you technically are shooting two shots with one trip full of the trigger. As you can see, I get another one. Trying to get a better one, but it just didn't happen. So for our final legendary, I go after Boom Boom for the bonus package. It's like the second main boss that you get in the game, and he drops a very good, unique grenade mod. The bonus package, when you throw it, it explodes, letting out loads of child grenades, then even more child grenades and even more. It lets out three rounds of mini grenades. As you can see here, it just melts for enemies. It's crazy. One, two, three. <laughs> it's crazy. Anyway, guys, I hope you enjoyed watching this as much as I did making it. Please hit that like button down below so we can get 10 likes on this video. Honestly, I wish I could make more videos on this. It just takes up so much more time because there's so much more grinding to do. Like this video alone took me about four hours to record in total for the simple fact of how long it took to farm the bosses because they were being so stingy. Also, make sure to check out the RC Genius. Hope you enjoyed. See you later.